Hello everybody, today I'm going to show you this GE Green Miser Floodlight Bulb. Now it puts out the light of a 100 watt bulb for only 85 watts. So here's the top of the package. We have the side, another side, and the back with some more information comparing it to a 100 watt floodlight bulb. So this is what is in the packaging. Um, as we will see in a moment. Oh, looks like I kept the bag from this purchase. Anyway, here is the bulb itself. You can see the GE logo there. Very nice. You can see the ribs inside of the bulb, which helps reflect the light more efficiently. As you can tell there, it is GE Watt Miser Floodlight, 120 volt, 85 watt and the date code is 96. I'm guessing it's made in 1996. But anyway, sadly this bulb does not work. And I bought it at a hardware store for this price, but the lady was gonna sell it to me for this price. What a bunch of junk. So I got it for this price, it doesn't work, but yet it is still a very good collectible item in my mind. So before they came out with this design, this was the design that they had, and this bulb does work, so you will get to see what the green looks like. And before they moved on to these, you can see they actually put flood there, GE did. And uh, there was a logo on the side, but it's not there anymore. The base tends to fall off these older bulbs, so electrical tapes hold them in place very nicely. So, we will screw this older bulb in, because like I said, that newer one doesn't work, sadly. Makes me very mad. But anyway, we'll shut off these lights and see what the GE Green looks like. It is very green. I really like the green of these bulbs. It's very nice, kind of a mercury vapor green. So it's a very nice color green. So hope you enjoyed this video of my GE Miser floodlight bulb and the original 100 watt, or I believe this one is 150 watts actually. But anyway, the halogen and the incandescent version of the GE floodlight bulbs in green. Hope you enjoyed this video and also please comment, rate, and subscribe. And thank you very much for watching.